Good evening, everyone, and welcome to today's presentation. Today, I'm going to talk about the pro use of anabolic steroids in an athlete in a professional sport. Today's title will be The Magic Juice, the other, the, the other Side of Anabolic Steroids, by me, Louis Berencourt. So everybody has a way that we enhance our life through our daily, through our daily routines. In the morning, we drink our coffee to get some energy to start our day. Or even when we go to play a sport, when we dress accordingly by having comfortable shoes, pair of light shorts and a light shirt so we can move freely and achieve any type of activity. Or even go into a job interview but we have to dress accordingly, put in our shiny shoes and a nice suit and tie, even do our hair to obtain the job that we want. Or even with our US military, where they equip our soldiers with helmets and body armor and weapons to fight the war against terror in overseas places. So what are anabolic steroids? And are there a magic juice? Well, generally speaking, anabolic steroids are a way to increase muscle strength very quickly. This generally means that people are able to train more often and longer in periods of time with improved recovery. Like the, defi that, like the definition says, they let people to train more often and recover faster. So in reality, they're not a magic juice. They're just helping that person to train more to the sport he's dedicated to. Everybody remembers the movie Space Jam, where supposedly Bucks Bunny finds Michael's secret water where he gives to the team giving some sort of magic energy to play against the opposing team when in reality it was just water. The team just have, just have the skills. They just need some motivation and also with the hard work of training, they were able to beat that opposing team. So what do we see here? To to our top of the screen, we have our favorite star from the California Bay Area, Mr. Barry Bonds, with a 73 home, home run season. The accomplishment, we got um, Lance Armstrong, where he completed seven tours of fractions consecutive as a gold medalist. And also we have our US American Ryan, Mr. Justin Gavin, where he won five times the 100 meter sprint in the Olympic scenario. So what do we all, all, all that have in common? They were criticized of their, of their use of anabolic steroids, but they never count the part that they, this gentleman right here, put time and effort in the specialty fears by bat batting a hundred balls a day in practice, by running thousands of miles before the Tour of France, or by practicing his sprint day in, day out, cold or hot, those athletes were there. They never, they never expected to a magic juice or the anabolic service to do their job. So I'm gonna tell about a small story about myself where I, use, I actually use a way to enhance myself in my past career as a US military. After a couple of deployments, I returned, I returned home with a couple of mental issues. One of them was concentration, where the doctors prescribed me a type of concentration medicine named Aril. Aril helped a stimulant to help my brain focus more to accomplish my task better. During the time I was taking the medicine, I was invited to compete in the U.S. Marine Corps shooting. 
competitions. Where through the effects of the medicines, I was effect, I was, uh, I was able to focus more by, by focusing that in that site and by seeing my my target clear and distances for 200, 300, and 500 yards. If this was cheating, no, just because I was prescribed the medicine, it was regulated. I wasn't trying to go out of my way. During the time I used and the time I competed and the way I performed, I, I made myself talk. What if all the Marines would got this medicine and be helping them to, helping them to concentrate more in their, in their daily, daily jobs as the Marine Corps, as a Marine daily work is not five to eight. They work 24 seven, seven days a week, nonstop, always on call. So why the banning and why some criticizing about anabolic steroids? Uh, Dr. Number Foss brought six, a list of six things that people criticize the anabolic steroids for. This first one being the offer and offer advantage. On first advantage are when nothing, nothing is regulated across the board. We can regulate it, disorder things such as the, Olymp the Olympic uh, policies re regulated running in high altitudes to help runners to improve their hemoglobin and oxygen levels as they run to, this, to the races. As also, another fact is that drugs are harmful. They could cause death or a serious illness. But actually, no study has shown that this drug can cause this. Furthermore, there's more death by playing the game of football and baseball. Some people say that their athletes are forced to use them. Actually, this is a choice. Nobody's forced to use this type of drugs. Another one is that undermine the fan interest. That's completely wrong. You and me as fan, fans of the sport, we'd like to see, we'd like to see the, the hard tackles in football and the long balls in baseball. Making us go back and forward and talk about to our friends to what we saw that day. The next one is that they don't mind the records. Well, if they don't mind the records, why, why actually things have changed through the years? Back in the day, when with the game of baseball, the, the fields were bigger, the fences were shorter, and the amounts of the pitches were lower, making the batter to, to obtain more home runs than ever, ever before. And last one is the, the show a bad role for children. Well, the show, the show of our role because we, we tell this is bad. We don't educate our children. And anyone's out there trying to force anabolic steroids to their children, they should be hung and then follow followed by a failed trial. So, so what is this, this debate about? It's all about what human performance. It's not about the magic juice that people think about the anabolic steroids will give. Give us magical skills to be an all-star. You still need to put the work to perform your sport. So tonight, after I'm done with this presentation, I, I want you to, when you get home, relax in your wine and relax with your family to think about this. And thank you. Thank you for all. Have a good day.